Have you ever asked Alexa a question, maybe about the weather or the capital of a country? Or have you ever watched a show on a streaming service that instantly suggests your next favorite video based on what you've already enjoyed? It's like it knows exactly what you want to watch. It feels like magic, doesn't it? Like someone is reading your mind. But it's actually something called artificial intelligence, or AI for short. It's not really magic, but it's pretty close. AI is like a special computer brain, a super smart program that can learn and make decisions. And it helps us in so many ways every day, often without us even realizing it. Think about when you play games against the computer, and it seems to get better the more you play. Or when you ask your phone to get directions to a new place. Or even when you use those funny filters on your photos that change your face or add silly effects. Most AI isn't a walking, talking robot like you see in movies. Instead, it's often invisible, working quietly inside your phone, making things run smoothly and efficiently, or your tablet, or even the navigation system in your car. It learns from the information it gathers, gets better at its job over time, and ultimately makes your gadgets smarter, more helpful, and a whole lot more fun to use. So even if you haven't actually met a physical robot, you've definitely used its brain in one way or another. Next time you get a great song suggestion from your music app, or hear a funny joke from a smart speaker that makes you laugh, remember, it's clever AI at work, making your digital world a little bit brighter and more entertaining. Let's dive in and discover what makes AI so amazing and how it's changing the world around us. So, what exactly does artificial intelligence mean? It's a term we hear a lot, but what's really going on behind the scenes? Let's break it down in a way that's easy to understand, even if you've never heard of it before. We're going to explore the core concepts and see how AI works in our everyday lives. Artificial means something that is made by humans, not something that occurs naturally. Think of it like building a house or creating a painting. It's something we design and construct. It's not found in nature, but rather, it's a product of human ingenuity and effort. And intelligence refers to the ability to learn new things, understand information, and solve problems effectively. It's about being able to think, reason, and figure things out. It's the kind of smartness that helps you do well in school and navigate the world around you. Put those two words together, and AI is essentially human-made smartness that lives inside a computer. It's about creating machines that can perform tasks that typically require human intelligence. It's like giving a computer a brain of its own, allowing it to think and act in intelligent ways. Imagine you're training a puppy to sit. You show it what to do and reward it when it gets it right. AI learns in a similar way, but instead of treats, it uses data. Lots and lots of data. It analyzes patterns and relationships within the data to improve its performance over time. The more data it processes, the better it becomes at making accurate predictions and decisions. Scientists and engineers show AI countless examples, like millions and millions of cat photos, for example. This helps it learn to spot a cat on its own, even in new and unfamiliar images. It's like teaching the AI to recognize the unique features and characteristics that define a cat. When your favorite app suggests a new video that you might like, that's AI at work, noticing patterns and trends from the behavior of millions of other users. It's analyzing your viewing history and preferences to make personalized recommendations. AI isn't some kind of magic trick. It's simply a computer program that learns from vast amounts of information and gets progressively smarter and more accurate with practice and experience. It can recognize spoken words, identify objects and pictures, and even play complex games like chess or go, all by learning from data and refining its strategies over time. Ultimately, AI is about teaching computers to make smart guesses and inform decisions in much the same way that you do every day when you're faced with a new challenge or problem to solve. Artificial intelligence, or AI, learns in a way that's surprisingly similar to how you do. It's not about memorizing facts from a textbook. Instead, it's a process of discovery and refinement, much like your own learning journey. AI learns by observing countless examples and, importantly, by making mistakes along the way. These errors aren't failures, they're valuable learning opportunities. Think about when you were a child, learning to distinguish between dogs and cats. You probably looked at lots of pictures, heard their names, 
and practiced identifying them until you consistently got it right. It was a hands-on, iterative process. AI follows a similar path, but on a much larger scale, processing thousands upon thousands of examples to recognize patterns and make accurate predictions. Consider a simple example, learning what a bicycle looks like. AI might be shown tons of bike photos from different angles, in various colors, and in diverse settings. Through this exposure, it learns key patterns and features, like bicycles have two wheels, a frame, and handlebars. And just like you when learning a new skill, AI gets better and more accurate with practice and repeated exposure. Each mistake it makes provides valuable feedback, helping AI to refine its understanding and improve its performance. It's similar to when you learn to ride a bike for the first time. You likely wobbled, maybe even fell a few times, and then adjusted your balance and technique after each fall. This iterative process of learning from data and refining its understanding is called machine learning. Instead of being explicitly programmed with a set of rules, AI figures out these rules on its own through practice. It doesn't learn by reading a giant, complicated rule book. It learns by doing. And because it's a computer, AI can learn at an incredibly fast pace. It can process and analyze more pictures and data in a single minute than you could possibly look at and comprehend in an entire year. That's precisely what makes AI such a powerful and potentially helpful tool for solving complex problems and assisting us in our daily lives. AI is everywhere, probably in your pocket right now. Your phone's camera uses AI to find faces and focus, and it predicts your next word when you text. In video games, AI creates smart opponents and builds amazing worlds. Some cars use AI to help drivers stay safe, like keeping the car in its lane or adjusting speed. Shopping sites use AI to suggest things you'll love. Music apps do the same based on what you've liked before. AI works quietly behind the scenes, making life easier, safer, and more fun. It's your invisible, helpful friend. Is AI smarter than you? In some ways, it can seem super smart. It solves math problems fast and finds patterns in huge amounts of data. AI can even spot tiny details in medical scans that doctors might miss. But AI doesn't have feelings, creativity, or imagination. It can copy art or music, but it can't dream up wild new ideas or understand emotions. You can invent games, tell stories, and make friends things AI can't do. AI is a tool, great at specific tasks, but it doesn't have common sense or curiosity. You're the one who asks why and imagines new worlds. So while AI is brilliant at information, you're brilliant at living life. AI doesn't work alone. It needs people to build, teach, and guide it. Scientists and engineers write the code and give AI good, fair information to learn from. If AI only saw pictures of male doctors, it might learn something untrue, so humans must teach it right. Even after training, AI needs a human partner like a doctor using AI to spot problems, but making the final decision themselves. AI is a teammate, not a boss. We decide what problems AI helps solve from medicine to art. Humans are always in control using AI as a powerful tool. We're the pilots, AI is our amazing co-pilot. By learning about AI, you're taking the first step to shaping its future. The skills you learn in math, science, and art all help build better AI. AI needs creative thinkers. Maybe you'll use it to design games, translate languages, or protect animals. The world of AI is just beginning, and there's so much to discover. Kids like you will make the next big breakthroughs by staying curious and asking big questions. Try coding, join a science club, or just keep exploring how technology works. The future of AI is in your hands. What amazing things will you do with it?